Hello guys and welcome to my London Fashion Week vlog. I'm starting this vlog in the beautiful home house suite. I'm staying in the Charlotte room and it's absolutely beautiful. I'm going to give you guys a tour right now. So far this is my room. I probably will take another um, picture and shoot some video footage tomorrow when it's a bit more daylight. It's just so so beautiful. And here is the piece de resistance, the bathroom. Absolutely beautiful. So, so gorgeous. Like I'm gonna enjoy getting ready for the shows in this bathroom. Um, I'm gonna quickly rush out because I need to get an outfit because I've just been invited to the Julian McDonald show. I'm so excited um, and a bit, like it's such a surreal moment. I cannot believe I got invited to Julie McDonald. I can't believe that I'm actually gonna get to vlog and see his wonderful designs. I'm just like in awe. So this London Fashion Week is honestly is like the best for me. Um, and yeah, oh! I'm like a little school girl. So I'm going to Debenhams right now and I'm gonna go and pick an outfit. Um, and to Zara. So I'm gonna rush now. Tomorrow I'm gonna try and keep this place clean so tomorrow I can take some nice pictures. And tomorrow's gonna be a busy day, so I'm looking forward to it. Good morning, guys. So today is my first official day of London Fashion Week, and I've just had the nicest bath in my bathroom. I washed my hair so it's all ready for the day, although I've broken out in some spots. It's all the stress of London Fashion Week. <laughs> but I've just had my breakfast arrive now, so I'm really looking forward to tucking in. And I've got a whole day jam-packed. From morning to evening, I'm on the go non-stop, so I need to refuel. So it is my breakfast this morning. Uh, my coffee, some croissants, even though I asked for a pan of chocolate and they didn't have it fresh orange juice and I wanted some all bran as well so I'm gonna tuck in to this before I head off to my first show. I'm just needing coffee so badly today. So guys, I finally just did my makeup ready for London Fashion Week. I've used only long wearing products because I am going to have a full day out and I won't be able to do any touch ups. So I'm wearing Urban Decay All Nighter foundation. I put a bit of um, Bare Minerals powder foundation on top. That is their pro long wear foundation. Um, lipstick is Urban Decay mixed in with a little bit of NYX. I will, if you guys want to know exactly what it is, I'll leave underneath. I think the lipstick is called Conspiracy. And that's about it. This top is from Zara and I've got this skirt. I might move into the bathroom actually and give you a better look of my outfit before I leave. Oh, the lighting's pretty... <laughs> orange in here but I've got also this skirt which is kind of like a green um metallic green as well um and that's about it I've kept everything kind of really simple I'm gonna take a scarf because it does look a bit chilly outside and that's about it I'm just gonna do a quick flat lay of some like London Fashion Week essentials and follow me on Instagram because you'll see close-up details of like the skirt and how gorgeous it is it's such a beautiful shade of green and yeah, that is about it. So I'm so excited for Julian McDonald. Um, so I'll see you guys at that show.
Um, party. Um, I'll write the hashtag so you guys can see, like, you know, from the party and stuff like that. I'm wearing this dress because it has an extra layer peplum here to hide this tummy because I'm actually feeling very bloated today. Um, and yeah, this is my outfit. It's from French Connection. Uh, my makeup is still from this morning. I'm so happy with the Urban Decay makeup. Honestly, it has lasted and ugh, this all-nighter is a good one. Absolutely love the detail of this dress. It is so gorgeous. And it's perfect for Christmas and New Year. It's a great little investment.
injuries, so go and follow her. Day two, I'm only doing one vlog for London Fashion Week. Um, so it's my day two at London Fashion Week and I'm just about to have some breakfast. My skin looks like I've got chicken pox. I really need to drink more water and stick to a routine um, because it's been so busy I haven't been sticking to my skincare routine. But today I did it this morning. So hopefully I will stick you know, I will maintain it. And I haven't been drinking a lot of water and I know that. So today I'm gonna to take a big bottle of water around with me and I'm just gonna drink it all. I'm just gonna have some breakfast now. Um, this hotel is just wonderful. I'm really enjoying my time here. Everyone's been wonderful. The food has been amazing. So this morning I decided to have some avocado, salmon, um, poached eggs and rye bread just to get me started for the day and I've got a coffee and an orange juice so I'm gonna tuck in get dressed and get ready for my backstage interview with Apu Jun I'm really looking forward to seeing his collection and seeing the girls at Crabtree as well and getting a massage so guys, I just wanted to check in because I am leaving now to go to my last couple of shows and I'm checking out this wonderful hotel. I'm so sad to be leaving. Um, I look a bit weird because I haven't done my makeup properly. I'm going to do it in the taxi because I'm running late. Hopefully next season I'll be able to do a hell of a lot more. Thank you so much to Crabtree and Evelyn for inviting me down and giving me giving me this amazing opportunity. Um, my battery actually died, so I'm filming this on my iPhone, so I hope the quality is good. I'm at that wonderful lounge right now. It's just so beautiful here. Um, and all of their products. Here, so I'm gonna chill out for a little bit before I head home. I'm actually super tired and I'm actually feeling quite under the weather. So 
Oh, I forgot to also mention, you can catch the interview that I did with Apu Jan on Crabtree and Evelyn's uh, Facebook page, and yeah, you'll be able to see the interview, so. I will end the vlog here, guys, and I'll catch you in my next one. Thank you so much for coming around London Fashion Week with me. I hope you guys really enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time.